Hi there, it's Mike from Motorstop. And I'm going to show you the benefits and features of our OS2800 carpet dryer. And a few things to notice about it is it is a roto molded case, which means it is unbreakable. I weigh almost 200 pounds. And as you can see, it doesn't even barely flex. Now, you want to compare this. It's a significant feature because a lot of the units that you'll find are either a split case injection molded or a blow molded. Either one of them, if you pick them up and drop them, they really can't handle because the, the motor is actually hung off the side. So a lot of times it'll flex and break the actual squirrel cage that's in there. So that's one thing. This unit is a three speed, high, medium, low. It also has a GFCI outlet on it, which means you can daisy chain other units, plug other units or other things, power tools or whatever into it. Now it is a three quarter horse, which means it is, uh, it draws about 6.8 amps when it's on high. Uh, that's, so you could only really daisy chain a few of these together, but it's really not meant to daisy chain a lot of them. It's meant as to, to be a one great unit that you have that just blows air like crazy. It's got a 30 foot long power cord on it. It's also got a convenient cord wrap so you can wrap it up. It's multi-positional, which means you can run it three different positions. One of the significant features of it, which may seem a little bit hokey, but actually is worth its weight in gold at times, is this little carpet clamp, which doesn't seem like a big deal. But the significant thing about that is that it allows you to go into an apartment like this and if there was a flood like the washing machine overflowed and there's water all over it would allow you to, to put this carpet put this underneath the carpet and lift up the carpet by blowing the air underneath it to allow it to dry without removing all the carpet or taking out all the padding which saves lots and lots of money and time I'm going to demonstrate that in a minute this unit's also stackable so you can stack a number of them together. It's not a small unit. It weighs about 32 pounds. And that means that it's really, really well made. So I'll show you real quickly how to do it. So assume this area was flooded because this is typically meant for drying floors, obviously, or moving air generally. Um, real quickly, I'll turn it on. This is, this thing blows like crazy. Can't tell, but there's a lot of air coming out of there. 2800 CFM is a lot. So I'll show you the application I was talking about. If you pull back the carpet here and you set the, the carpet dryer in there, and you set it in like this in the corner, you would fold this up like this, lift up on the carpet clamp, clamp it in place. And you might say, What's the big deal? I could just put that up on top of there. But believe me when I tell you that if you try and set this up on here, it may sit up there for five minutes, but if you come back tomorrow, the carpet's just gonna be flopped right over. So if you, you're gonna need to let it dry for a long period of time, this is the only way it will work. So once I go ahead and turn this on, it's gonna actually lift up all the carpet and, and blow air underneath this whole area. You can do a huge, large area with this thing. So flip this on. What this is going to do now, and it's going to lift up, you can see it lifts up the, so what you want to do is put a couple of weights, something on both, both sides, and it's blowing air on the whole carpet. It actually, you can, did it on, you probably want to do it on low. Did it on high, and lift it up, and potentially pull it off the outside tack strip. As you can see, what happens is we continue to blow the air underneath there. Now what's important is that if you do this with a carpet dryer, ours, this, this 2800 is made with a three-quarter horse thermally protected motor, which means it can stand up to that. If you try and do that with a lesser grade unit, it'll burn out the motor and potentially cause either the circuits to break or uh, worst case scenario might be a fire or something like that. So if you have any uh, need any more information on that or any of our other professional grade products, please visit orderstop.com.